Hey everyone, Bobby here from TabletCrunch.com. Hope that you're having an awesome day. Um, lots of people in the comments of the articles I'm writing about this iOS 6 Wi-Fi connectivity issue. Uh, people are just outright getting upset. Uh, the reality is, I know you're not going to want to hear this, the reality is you're either going to upgrade to IPv6, you're going to upgrade your wireless routers to IPv6, or your iOS 6 device isn't going to connect to your Wi-Fi uh, network. It, it's really that simple. So the only exception to that is the iPhone 3GS and the iPhone 4. The wireless cards that are in those two devices can upgrade to iOS 6 and it'll be fine connecting on the old, what is now really considered outdated routers and the protocol of IPv4. Um, however, iPhone 4S, iPhone 5, iPad 2 and 3, once you have those devices on iOS 6, which obviously the iPhone 5 it comes with iOS 6, once you upgrade the iPhone 4S, iPad 2, iPad 3 to iOS 6, the reality is your wireless router has to be IPv6, or I'm sorry, you upgrade to iOS 6, your wireless router has to have IPv6 protocol. Reason being is, Every time an Apple device, iPhone or iPad, connects to a Wi-Fi router, there's a, an, an authentication token that goes, it really happens that fast, but it goes from your device to Apple servers and it sends back an authentication token verifying that that is a legitimate Apple product and device that you're using. Well, with iOS 6 on the 4S, the 5, the iPad 2, iPad 3, on iOS 6, the transmission of that data packet, the authentication token that goes to Apple servers and back to your device, that has to happen on an IPv6 protocol. If IPv6 protocol doesn't exist, that authentication token, that communication isn't going to happen, and that means that your wireless device or your, your device, your iPhone or your iPad running on iOS 6, is not going to connect to your wireless router or your wireless network. Some people are responding to me, does that mean you're telling me that Starbucks, my house, everyone in my city, you're telling me that unless all those people upgrade their wireless routers to IPv6 protocol, then I'm not gonna be able to connect to those wireless routers? That's exactly correct, that's exactly right. Unfortunately, it, it doesn't matter if it's Starbucks, if it's your house, if it's City Hall, if it's the Empire State Building in the middle of New York City, if the wireless network is not running a firmware that supports IPv6, your iPhone and iPad running iOS 6 is not getting on the wireless network, period. Okay, you can cut it off.